Hey guys, welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you are new. So today is January 30th. Crazy, crazy time is just flying. Um, and it's 9, 12 in the morning. So I am just working, um, getting some stuff done. I've been up since six this morning. I, well, Brad went snowboarding with his friends super early and then I was up. As soon as I heard him, I was like, yep, I'm not going back to bed because we got literally so much snow yesterday. So I just wanted to make sure that he like got to his destination safe because I wasn't sure how the roads were. But yeah, so was on TikTok, of course, not being productive. But in my defense, it's a Sunday at 6 a.m. Uh, took Riggins out and then moved our cars because like I said, we got a huge snowstorm and they need to plow. Um, so... It's literally insane how much snow there is. Brad already like had shoveled and brushed off all the snow off the cars. I just had to move it. <sighs> Life's so tough, but um, so I had to do that. And now I'm just working. I do need to leave here soon for my workout class just because I need to get gas. Um, so I, so I drive the Jeep. Brad drives the car for the most part, but I want him to take the Jeep today. And he obviously wanted to just because it's better with the snow. And I get in to start it, to move it. And I'm like, oh, I always say, and they always say, do not leave your car with low gas when they're, when it's cold out and when there's a snowstorm. So I'm like, oh my God, stressed. Um, it's fine. And he obviously didn't know that, that he was going snowboarding. So I like texted him. I was like, let's not leave the car on E for gas during the snowstorm. And he was like, crap. Like I didn't realize you were going to be taking it. I was like, still don't because I don't want him to get stuck or something so yeah I just have to leave here soon totally fine there's a gas station right up the road but then I have my workout class I'm going to come home and just have a productive Sunday so to give you guys like kind of my game plan so I have my workout class until 11 30 my sister and I are going to grab like a shake or a tea um, from a place that's like right next door and then I want to come home and like clean I'm doing pretty good with laundry. I just need to put it away. Like, honestly, if I showed you the amount of clothes that I have to put away. Wow. Um, and then I need to clear out the fridge. I have a lot of fruit that I need to get rid of. So I'm thinking what I'll do. It's just not a lot, but I just really try not to be like wasteful. I think I'm going to use my juicer and make a juice. We'll see. I have raspberries, bananas. No, no bananas. Raspberry, apples pineapple I feel like that'd be good so maybe I'll make a juice um and use my juicer because I really want to start using it and the fruit's gonna go bad so I might as well right um so yeah that's something I really want to do sounds like kind of small and would probably take like 10 minutes of my time but um and just plan for the week so I have my planner right here I think I'm gonna move things around I'm thinking because I liked having the podcast go up on Tuesdays I kind of want to stick with that or Wednesday so I think YouTube video might go up on Sunday I've always had done Sunday and I feel like now nobody posts on the weekends but I love Sundays I feel like Sundays are such a good day to like catch up do laundry watch YouTube and it's just a good day so especially where I'm so busy during the week so that's what I'm thinking and then Mondays I do my workout classes so it was just hard to record or what am I saying like upload and record for the podcast if I needed to so at least taking off the YouTube video like uploading on Monday that's one thing off my plate for Monday I don't know if I'm making any sense so I think YouTube videos will now go up on Sundays and then um podcast on Tuesday or Wednesday I'm still trying to think I don't know comment below Tuesday or Wednesday um I've been slacking on the podcast game so I need to just like get my ducks in a row and like I said Brad is snowboarding so I figure this is a good day to like get what I need done I also need this is really bad I really need to get my wedding thank yous out like I needed to get them out like yesterday <laughs> so bad i need to get them out i i know so we're gonna work on that but today like i need to get those out today um i know you technically have a year but um my cousin got married after me and she already sent hers out and i was like crap i really need to get mine out so we'll do that we'll get it done anyways i'm going to stop because my sister just called me and i'm going to see what's going on and i'll check in with you guys later on 
Okay guys, so it is now like 1.30 and I haven't vlogged. So um, I apologize. I had my workout class from 10.30 to 11.30. My sister and I went and got protein shakes and I didn't bring my camera. I actually left like super early because um, she ha like had to leave her apartment or something because they were um, plowing and there was like nowhere for her to move her car. So she got there super early. So I felt bad. So I joined her. Um, and then we did our workout class. We went and got protein shakes, um, at a place. I think I told you guys. And then she needed to go to the store. Target happens to be right there. So we ran into Target. Um, I didn't get much. I actually only got four things. thought it was three, but four. So I'll show you guys. But this was today's workout fit top is from nike and then my leggings are from old navy it was a good class i'm so happy because yesterday couldn't go because of the snowstorm it canceled um so i was happy to be back in the gym but i like really need to clean <laughs> uh, my sister and i were like oops we need to like get home and have productive sunday um, okay, so definitely not healthy, but I got a spicy nacho Dorito chips. I don't really have snacks. I'm going to go to the market tomorrow. I got myself two energy drinks because figured I'm always stopping at Target to get these. So I just picked some up while I was there. Stock up. So I got the Alani New Tropical and Mimosa, which are two flavors that I don't normally go for. So, And then I picked up this. It was on clearance. My skin is super dry. So it's this glow and hydrate day serum. Um, so I'm excited to use it from the brand Bliss. It was on sale for six bucks, originally 20. So I'm gonna try it. Um, show you guys what it looks like. I'll let you know. I like it, but super cute. I definitely need to like start investing more in skincare and even makeup. Like I haven't bought makeup in a minute. I don't really wear it. Um, but anyways. We are going to be productive because let me know if you're like this. I always put like especially makeup back in its like original packaging. <laughs> Anyways, I am hungry. I got a shake, so she got a tea and I got a protein shake. And I'm still like hungry. And it was pretty filling. I didn't finish all of it because it was really sweet. I got a white chocolate Reese's protein shake. I just broke a nail. Um, so it kind of hurts, but I'm just gonna have some leftover soup. And I do want to still make the juice that I was telling you guys about because the pineapple and raspberries and apples are going to go bad. So we'll see how that goes. That's why I got a shake instead of the tea. But yeah, tomorrow my workout class is until 5 p.m., which I'm kind of excited about. The roads, the main roads aren't bad, but the back roads aren't cute. <laughs> I was sliding. Brad's car, my car too, but the car is not good in the snow. It was actually really scary, so I'm happy to be home. But all right, we need to be productive. This nail is going to annoy me. Um, but anyways, I really need to get them done. They're so bad, but all right. First things first, I got a shower because I feel gross. I need to take out the trash too, but I don't want to do that right now. So we'll do that after. <laughs> Okay, so it is now 3.20. Wow, today is flying. Um, and something that I want to do on Sundays, or actually I showered, um, of course. I was so sweaty after the gym. I took a bath. I was like, I could really go for a bath. And I was like, I might as well do it now. I did a face mask. Usually I like to do that at night, but I was like, you know what? I'm in for the day. Why not? So <clears throat> 
I did that. I just ate because I was starving. I haven't had anything to eat today. So I just made or heated up some leftover soup. And on some days I want to start going through the fridge, seeing like what we need to get rid of, um, kind of clearing it out, see what ingredients I have for nails for the following weeks coming up. So I'm going to do that. So I don't think I'm going to do a juice as much as I want to. I'm just going to grab ingredients at the store tomorrow, but I don't really have that much fruit, like just these raspberries, two apples, and then some um, pineapple. I just, I don't know if it's going to make enough. So I'm like nervous. <laughs> so I think we're going to pass on the juice as the, although I really, really want to do it. I feel like it's going to make such a mess for just like such a small amount of liquid. So we're going to pass on that, but yeah, honestly, we are pretty good this week. We didn't really waste much, which is just something I really want to try and get better at. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna, this is what I use. I'm gonna um, do this later when I'm like planning my week, which I like to do at night. Um, but yeah, I just write down like what we're gonna have for meals. So like on Monday, I did the balsamic chicken that we really like. Tuesday, I did chicken pot pie. Wednesday, buffalo chicken sandwiches. Thursday, tacos. Friday, we got takeout. And then yesterday, I made tomato chicken soup, which is what I just had. And then tonight, I'm making carbonara. I don't know if I told you guys that. Um, I think these raspberry, honestly, I feel like they're... No, I could probably still pick at them tonight. Um, but, like, we have leftovers. This has been in here for a little bit. Um, and then the chicken pot pie. I don't know about you guys, but how I leave leftovers in the fridge for so long so i just want to get better at that um but i'm really happy usually i waste my fruit like really bad but we actually went through all of it strawberries bananas apples the lemons that i bought cucumber so usually produce goes bad bad fast so i'm very happy about that so love that now i need to do the dishes um because we ran out of room yesterday so I always try to never have dishes in the dishwasher, but that's okay. So I'm going to watch Kardashians. I have my seltzer water with cucumber and a wine glass because why not? Um, but yeah, then I'm just going to like plan out for the week. Need to do laundry. I can't believe I'm going to show you guys this. I hope you can't see my dishes. <laughs> Look at this mother load of laundry. So we're going to do that. Okay, but first we are going to do the dishes, so that's taken care of. Um, and maybe I'll just like pick out this fruit because that actually sounds pretty good. I wish I could do the juicer, but that's all right. I am going to throw away these raspberries. I'm looking at them. They look a little squishy. There's some that have like little yellow marks, so I'm going to assume they went bad. And then I'm going to cut up an apple and dip that in peanut butter because that sounds really good too. So... Probably have a late dinner. I don't think Brad will get home until later tonight. <clears throat> I honestly haven't heard from him. I was like, Brad, I'm kind of getting nervous. Is everything okay? Um, so yeah, we'll do that. Let's cut up some apple and cut up the rest of this pineapple. Pick up that. I'll have this last apple tonight as my dessert. That's the game plan. And then, yeah, the fridge looks good. We have stuff for carbonara and lunches tomorrow. And then, like I said, I go to the market tomorrow. So I'm gonna make my grocery list and just do all the things. I also need to edit today's video since I am changing around my uploading schedule. All right, I've been rambling for four minutes. I just want to update you guys. Hey, wait, last little update. But I just realized I haven't told you guys. So I finished Malibu Rising. I need to put on my like real wedding ran ring. <laughs> ran oh my gosh so finished malibu rising um this rain i wear when i'm working out but um really liked it i give it a nine out of ten so my sister and i we do a book club every month just her and i um we just like read a book together and not like together but the same book and we discuss it um and we both really liked it. She's finishing up today. And then I started The Silent Patient. This is February's book. But I'm kind of getting a head start. Just because I finished already. And we were snowed in. But this book is, I think is going to be really good. So Malibu Rising. If you haven't read it. Or if you're currently reading. Skip over this part. But or I guess I'm just giving you my thoughts on it. I thought it was really good. 
I gave it a 9 out of 10 on Instagram. Um, I do think it could have been better. The ending, I was kind of like, mm, like, I don't know. I think it was overly hyped. But this book, I already could tell that I'm going to like it. I'm not even that far into it. But I don't know. I just feel like, I guess I didn't really understand the hype of Malibu Rising. It was good. I did give it a 9 out of 10. But I did just claim that out of all the books that I've read recently, which is not a lot, Hocus Pocus, The Guest List, which is a really good one, um, some like Christmas book, what else? I think that's it. Um, oh, and then The Weekenders by Mary Kay Andrews. Um, Malibu Rising has been the best one yet, but like I don't have a lot of books to compare it to, but I feel like it's going to blow this one out of the water. My sister did say that Malibu Rising is good, but it wasn't her favorite and she like loves reading. But I, I don't know. Let me know if you guys felt the same way if you read that. Um, but yeah, again, I, we're currently reading this. She's going to start it, I think, tonight. And I definitely, once I like finish doing everything that I need, I definitely want to um, read. I did read a little bit in the bath, but then I was like, okay, I need to like get out. It's two o'clock. Why am I taking a bath? Um, but yeah, a little update for you guys on my book. It's now five o'clock. I've been watching Kardashians and started laundry. Um, but I am going to plan out my outfits for the week. Something I try to do. Um, I don't necessarily get like super dressed up. I just like to get dressed because um, I hate wearing like my pajamas all day since I do work from home. Um, tomorrow I have to take a photo for a brand deal. So it is a protein powder, which I'm really excited about. Um, so it's fitness um brand so i need to wear like workout wear this car keeps like circling around my complex you good okay. riggins are you okay he keeps like um dry heaving you okay come on up he's been doing it since yesterday he like acts fine i just i don't know anyways um so pick out our outfits and i'm actually gonna start dinner now because brad should be home within like the next 45 minutes and I've never made carbonara before so I feel like it's gonna take a little bit um and he said that he's pretty hungry so he keeps asking what we're having I'm like I'm not telling you so I'm gonna start dinner I need to change over laundry and I need to put laundry away that is like the main thing dinner is served haven't tried it have a diet coke but it looks really good same for my first time making it not bad